My practice is as a design researcher is agnostic to content areas. Um, I've researched many topic areas, uh, including experiences at the end of life, including our relationship to technology, uh, including ways in which we can approach uh, policy making through the tools of design, uh, mainly around how we come together, how multiple stakeholders from different points of view um, can be supported by an atmosphere for immersive exchange. Uh, these have been my research topics. Um, I'm a transdisciplinary designer, design ethnographer, a researcher, um, and uh, I privilege the notion of, of methods and an approach um, more so than I do uh, certain content areas. I'm also very interested in um, image-oriented um, artifacts and devices within these processes of exchange. Um, storytelling and cinematic tropes as design tools, not simply as a way to reflect information or record or archive information. I certainly was interested to come to this conference and address affordable housing because I do believe that housing along with healthcare and education um, are human rights um, and the ways in which we as a society might move toward a future uh, that includes um, these services um, as human rights uh, is, a, is a huge idea. Uh, this is a direction we should be moving in and it's a complicated path. So I was, I've worked in um, expanded notions of care, health care, experiences at the end of life, um, I work as an educator um, and I'm, I'm very, very interested in issues around housing as well. In terms of um, next big topics for sustainability, the scholar and practitioner Tony Fry in his book, Design as Politics, says uh, the notion of sustainment might even be more applicable than sustainability. Um, how do we sustain ourselves? And maybe the questions that that raises, what does it mean to sustain? Um, we can't consider notions of sustainment or sustainability through um, the lens of, of, of late capitalism. We can't only look at the conditions and issues from within those structures. Uh, we have to look and imagine outside of those structures. As, as um, Mark Fisher quoting, um, quoting um, I believe Frederick Jameson, who was quoting someone else, it's, it's, it's easier to imagine the end of the world than it is to imagine the end of capitalism. And what he's referring to is this is a certain kind of profit-driven growth contingent um, system. Um, we have to kind of think more expansively, not only within those systems, but um, outside of them creatively. And I think that, that uh, sustainment and sustainability demand that.